In this video, I'm going to teach you how to connect Redragon K530 Bluetooth. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to properly set up the Redragon K530 and connect it over Bluetooth. You will be able to connect this keyboard to any device that supports Bluetooth connections. So, to start, unbox the keyboard and usually there will be a toggle on the keyboard itself. All that you have to do is make sure that it is set to Bluetooth or BT. So once this toggle is set to Bluetooth, you will be able to connect it. Go over to your device, either a PC, a mobile device or whatever it is that you are trying to connect it to and make sure that Bluetooth is enabled. With, with Bluetooth enabled on that device and the toggle on the keyboard set to BT or Bluetooth, you will be able to power it on. Immediately upon powering on the K530, it will go into pairing mode immediately. So all that you have to do now is find it under the list of available devices on your PC, phone and so on. As long as Bluetooth was enabled and you power it on the keyboard with the toggle set to BT, it is automatically going to appear under the list. So choose it from there and immediately upon selecting it, it will remain connected indefinitely. You will be able to use it as long as it has sufficient battery. So charge it if needed and then choose it from the list of available devices. You can use it completely wirelessly on any device that supports Bluetooth connections. And as soon as the connection is established once, it is going to remain connected. The other toggle at the right side of the Bluetooth options refers to the devices where you can use this Redragon keyboard. So you can connect it to three devices and use the toggle to switch between them. So let's say that you connect it to a PC, a console, and a phone. Just use the toggle and switch it between those three devices. So you can leave it paired up and it will automatically connect once you toggle it into the corresponding device. I hope I was able to help you on how to connect Redragon K530 Bluetooth. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.